Good morning, everyone. It's the next day, um, December 26th. Didn't have that much of a Christmas, so whatever. Um, today's video is going to be about me redoing my entire setup. So, yeah. Well, let's get to it. Uh, if, if you have an Elite controller and you don't know what the little bottom bumpers do on the bottom of your controller, you just turn into this. Little uh, controller spider. Rocking a uh, Alienware 17R5. You already know it's the G502. <laughs> Slightly modded uh, Huntsman, Razor Huntsman. Very nice keyboard. Also, the cable ties are, come with the keyboards and the mice that you get sometimes from Razor. Very useful for cable management when you have a desk set up. Plastic mouse pad, nothing special. A three year old razor headset. Uh, inside cup right here, actually. Deteriorating. Leather's deteriorating, so I gotta either find a replacement muff or get a new headset. But I won't do that until this one completely dies out. Logitech gives you a free coaster with your uh, mouse pad purchase. So you ever get a mouse pad like this? You look on the little hexagonal box on the bottom, it gives you a little free coaster. Very nice. This is what I've been using to prop up my um, laptop so it get better airflow. It's literally just a piece of frame board, nothing special. Um, I do want to replace this in the future, but so far, that's all we got to work with. Literally, it's just my desk. This is a poster, a wooden poster that I use for my desk. Clean up duty. <laughs> if you ever get a um, projector like this, or like the one that I have right there. And it comes with this case, fucking keep this case. It's it's great for keeping your mouse pads or your peripherals together while you completely redo your setup. So uh, yeah, I use uh, clothes bins to or Tupperware boxes to basically make my desk. Work with what you got, you know? Sorry, <sighs> okay. right, that's totally stable. For reference, this thing weighs about 10 to 13 pounds, so... I'm going to have to do some peanuts. BRB. I think this uh, setup right here, the way I've got this laid out, is actually pretty nice. So, this is what we're going to go with for now. Unplugged 
for the time being. Just because I don't have enough USB ports um, to actually plug it in and use it. I will, however, invest in a um, USB dongle so I can actually plug in my headset and use it. And my, and my controller. Honestly, not too bad. Okay, well, I got that done. Uh, now I just need to reconfigure the drivers, everything, you know, fix everything in the software, and, and uh, yeah.